Okay, hello guys, this is Victoria Experts and Sam. Welcome to a bit of a unfamiliar video. Uh, yeah, this is a stream. Uh, I'm only doing this just because I know some people will be interested to see me uh, open this and, you know, this rare uh, model. Um, yeah, it's quite a rare model. Uh, as you all know, we're on the AMS gift store, it's all sold out. Uh, yes, yeah, the British Airways land all livery and literally I'm just gonna do kind of like a similar video to what I do on the extra channel. Uh, I'm not reviewing it, I'm not doing any of that, I'm not rating it out of its box or mould or landing gear. Instead actually, I think uh, maybe tomorrow or maybe Tuesday I've got a video coming out on that channel. Um, yeah, the extra channel. Um, yeah, basically of my uh, Virgin Atlantic 747 review, which uh, yeah, uh, I... Uh, yeah, basically uh, asked for a poll between the A380 and that model. Um, yeah, the Virgin 747 a few weeks ago. Uh, and yeah, uh, Dylan's here. Hello, Dylan. You're actually watching this live. Uh, I know this is a very uh, similar uh, style of recording I do to, you know, the model reviews, but I'm not rating any model. Uh, I got this from the gift store today. Um, and I, I know, the, I know the, the store of the gift people will get annoyed and I probably shouldn't say this because it will probably affect their reputation. But uh, yeah, as you can see, se sold for Mike, collect Sunday, checked. So basically on Tuesday, uh, my dad went in and basically said, oh, I think it was Wednesday or something. Basically, he made an inquiry, basically saying, um, can we, not, not pre-order, but can you hide this under the counter? So they did that. They hid this under the counter for about five days and just stuck this on the top, basically saying sold to Mr. Lockett. So yeah, and we collected it today at the gift store. Uh, and yeah, hello Dylan. Yeah, I hope you're well. Um, and yeah, uh, sorry that I wasn't in the stream. I woke up too late. And uh, it's weird doing a video in bloody, yeah, it's, I'm just in my conservatory. So yeah, this is basically, we've got a broken Rubik's cube. Uh, I'm just doing this on this table just uh, because yeah, it's the best light. So yeah, uh, I think we should get straight into it. This is a pretty rare model. Uh, I don't know how rare it is, but apparently they boxed about three of them uh, in the last few days. When the guy at the gift store said, yeah, we um, sent about three of these off the other day. I don't know if he meant th this exact one, because we've got A380s, but honestly, guys, in the gift store at Manchester, this is the only one. Uh, was this the last one, or do they have several? No, I think this is the last one, Dylan. This is the last one they have at the gift store, uh, and unfortunately I've bought it. Uh, I've also bought a uh, British Airways A321neo, uh, which was the last one on Amazon as well. Um, so yeah, I don't know how many people are going to get annoyed with me. Honestly, people have me pinned against the fence, beating me up as one of them's landing. So I think we should get into it. I'm going to take this off because I don't think they'll appreciate me having that on. But anyway, yeah, I think we should get into it. I don't know how I'm going to do this because uh, I'm on this very small tripod and uh, I don't really want to be reaching over and all that. But yeah, uh, I think we should just start with opening it like this. Uh, if you've ever opened a 1 to 400 or 1 to 200 model, uh, it's a little bit more, not complicated, but uh, you haven't got all the information like you do on the Gemini uh, 400s. I think you flick the hatch here, there's like a little latch, uh, and we end up destroying this table. Um, or there's a seller tape over it. Oh god, I can't, I can't say, oh I'm going to skip ahead because it's live. Um, hang on, here we go guys, I've got it. Hang on, it's just a little complicated, I haven't done this for ages, but here we go, as you can see, Flick the latch there, and then it opens. As you can see, this, this is gonna be pretty cool. Uh, and then you open it like that. I'm just gonna have a, there we go, that's better. So you can see what I'm doing. As you can see, Boeing 747 Landor. Um, it says it all on these sides here. Same here. I just don't wanna ruin this tablecloth, that's all. So I don't really like spinning it round. Uh, yeah, Gemini Boeing licensing uh, and all that. As you can see, pretty nice. Sorry, my fingernails are dirty as well, so. Yeah, because I've been picking my nose. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I do while I'm waiting for these models. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, here we go. Oh no, we have to take the thing off, don't we? Yeah, here we go. Oh wow, this is amazing. So if you can hear neighbours as well, so if you can hear little children. But yeah, here we go, guys. Um, here we go. <laughs> that's gonna, this is going to be quite a quick stream. I'm just going to unbox it. I've actually got the uh, landing gear for my Virgin 747 just because I'm going to unbox, I'm going to wrap this up and, and unbox it again because I want to unbox, um, I, I need the Chaffin Dockyard livery. I've got the Landor, I've got the Nagus and I've got the, uh, the you know, the BOAC. This is the Landor one. Uh, I can't believe I'm touching it as well. Um, I, I know some people will literally, you know, fight me over this, but um, yeah, this is just, it hasn't got flaps down. It's just flaps retracted and all that. Um, and yeah, Let's uh, get straight into it. Yeah, I've got to unbox this again, though. Um, 
as well as you know the Lando and the Nagus and the um, BOAC and the, you know the Chaffin Dockyard livery. The Chaffin Dockyard livery is the only one I need, and they've got all of them. Uh, oh God, here we go! Everyone's joined. Uh, hello, Sam. I wasn't going to buy one of these. Um, anyway, too much for me. Yeah, let's see it. Yeah, hello, Craig. Hello, everyone again. I've done three streams today. I did an Oblivion video this morning, and that's going to be out later. It's just rendering now in Final Cut. Uh, or pending or whatever, uh, and then we're gonna do a stream on Oblivion, uh, uh, Doom Eternal later on Twitch. Like, I've got, that's like three videos, four videos, that's ridiculous, but yeah. Um, no, no, five videos. I, 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 yeah, I'm gonna be shattered, I'm not gonna be able to go to school tomorrow. But yeah, I'm gonna unbox the four models again, I'm gonna unbox this again, I'm not gonna take out the landing gear, instead I'm just gonna borrow it, borrow it from my Virgin, this is from my Virgin 747, uh, one to 200. Um, and yes, just because I'm going to unbox this again in four model unboxing on my SLE, if that makes sense. Um, and yeah, let's take it out. I, I, I want to be careful because I don't want to ruin it. And I know polystyrene sometimes breaks models. Oh my God, look at this. Yeah, that's cool. I know it is. Uh, yeah, Unruly Phantoms here. Hello. Yeah, this was about £160, by, oh, £160, by the way. Um, this is expensive. This is a really, really expensive model. <laughs> Yeah, I want to be careful because I know some people will fight me over this. Yeah, as you can see, this is very, very nice. We just bought it today. We just thought, right, this is the last one. Let's buy it. It hasn't got that... No, it hasn't got the uh, the slippery feel. Yeah, it's all metal. It's not... Even this... You know when a model's rare? Like, I know Dylan doesn't know much about this because I know he hasn't been watching the school streams, but uh, I've basically just been talking to Aviation413 and he basically knows that uh, I've had this on the books for a little while. Like on Tuesday, we just went in there and just saw it and I was like, right, okay, we need to... We need to uh, look at this, Dad. We need to we need to buy it. And here we go. That's it. This is the mould. Um, very, very nice, as you can see. I don't know where I'm going to put this. I'm going to put it in my room. Uh, so, yeah, and hopefully I'm not going to put it... Uh, I have two Concords from Gemini, and they cost me around uh, 145 Yeah, I know. Pretty crazy. Look, there you go. There's the, the Fly to Serve emblem there. Very, very nice. Um, yeah, uh, GBOAC and GBOAB. Yeah, this is a uh, Golf... Uh, Bravo November Lima Yankee. Uh, that's the uh, registration on this. And there we go. Look at this. Oh, lovely. It's like bluey inside. Yeah, really, really nice. Um, and this is it from above. As you can see, very, very nice. Wings, engines. Again, on these moulds, I do think that the, the cockpit is just a little low down. I think it just needs to be a, a tad little bit taller. And then, yeah, it would be perfect. But now I'm just going to put the landing gear on. Oh dear, um, this is from my Virgin, I've got to view the way. People will tell me, there we go. Front landing gear, uh, we just need to put the other landing gear on, which goes, which way does it go? It goes that way, doesn't it? There we go. And then the other one, people will tell me if I've got them the wrong way, trust me. Um, hang on a minute, this is just a little complicated. Just from the angle and all that. There we go. Come on, get in place. Yeah, it's all magnetic, guys. These. These landing gears are magnetic. We just slop in. Slop in! Slot in! Let me rephrase that. Oh, come on. Let's go. Yeah, there we go. There we go. And I think, I'm assuming the landing gear would actually be... No, it wouldn't be painted, would it? And there we go. So, yeah, and avi oh, Aviation... Uh, yeah, Aviation LB, you didn't win the giveaway, by the way, for the, uh, the keychains. Uh, who won was Mari and um, a HC Aviation. They they're the people who won. Um... And yeah, there we go, as you can see, British Airways Landor. <laughs> like, I just can't believe I've got this. I'm, I'm incredibly lucky to have it. And yeah, I knew I was going to get it, but I thought, oh, no, I'm going to end up having to buy it on eBay and all that. But yeah, this is a pretty rare model. Uh, this is the actual landing gear. Yeah, it is painted blue, yeah. But I'm going to be unboxing that when I unbox it on the SL Aviation, because I'm going to be unboxing four of them once I've got the Chaffin Dockyard livery. Um, this is the stand. Oh, I wish you would come with a plaque. That's something I do wish. And it's got a little screw in there just in case you need to adjust it. And then you just pop it in there, like so, and then you've got it on a bloody stand. There we go, guys. That is the uh, British Airways Landor uh, 747. So I need to keep all the paper and all that, all the, all the, uh, you know, the plastic sheets on it just to protect it. There we go. Uh, I'm sorry uh, if anyone was looking at this in the gift store the other day. Um, <laughs> I bought it and we had a little discussion with the... Uh, the people at the RVP just about me 
um, potentially having this <laughs> uh, without everyone, anyone knowing it. I know I probably shouldn't say this on YouTube because it kind of affects their reputation, but if anything, it's great service. It's good customer service from, um, you know, the RVP. And, you know, I, I just knew because their customer service is amazing and I knew they'd remember it. And, oh yes, you know, I've been told about the model, sir. And that kind of gave me all the confidence that they had this and yeah, amazing. Uh, absolutely lovely model. Hope you've all enjoyed it. Uh, again, I'm not doing a review. If you want me to do a review, uh, I might I might do a review of it. I don't know, maybe in the distant future, uh, whenever that might be. I just wanted to stick to. I know this is the Virgin uh, landing gear, but I just wanted to uh, put it on just so it looks a little bit more complete. Nose gear uh, is the wrong way round, is it? You know it isn't. No, it is, isn't it? It isn't. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Like that. I G. That's from the Virgin. No, 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 no. It's not Dylan because. The, the light here, the landing gear light, uh, is actually a dual, as you can see, so it would be this way. Um, so yeah, just in case you didn't know, because the, um, the dual, uh, that's what that's the landing gear light. See that, the little dual? Yeah, that, that's meant to be the nose wheel light. Um, not the landing gear light, the, the nose wheel light, so yeah. There we go, isn't that absolutely amazing? Oh my god, yeah, I just love it. It's a beautiful mould. I mean, I think the cockpit could have been just risen a little bit. Uh, it's kind of a little bit far down, whereas on the Gemini 400s, they've actually got it perfect. Um, but no, you can't get this model anywhere. I think you can get it on eBay. Uh, I would like to tell people where to get it, but I honestly don't know. Um, <laughs> just come to my house and rob. <laughs> That's what you could do. Um, and yeah, as you can see, I, I might as well show, I just want to show, give you it from all angles. There's the fly to surf livery. Uh, sorry, the logo. There you go. As you can see, very, very nice. And there's the, uh, the little hump at the top, a little bubble. Very, very nice. It's just a lovely model. <laughs> yeah, very, very nice. And we've got that kind of speed bird thing there. Go another way down and around. The, uh, the airplane tail there. Uh, again, it's flaps up, it's not flaps down. Uh, we've got the uh, RB211s there uh, for the engines powering them. Uh, and yeah, as you can see, very, very nice model. Uh, no, nose uh, gear is wrong way. Look at that picture online uh, and you can see, is it? I don't think it is. No, no, no. It shouldn't be like that. Because the, uh, the, the lights on here, see the little jewels? Yeah. They're, 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 they're pointing that way. So the, yeah, the nose wheel light should be facing that way. Uh, and also this is uh, India Golf. So if it was the other way, it would have been... Well, I don't know. I'll, I'll, just, I'll just stick it the other way, just keep doing happy. There we go. <laughs> yeah. So is it this way? There we go. Is that, is that better? Yeah, I, I, yeah, I, I don't know why. The, well, I don't know. Uh, I mean, turn the wheel round. What, the wheel? Or, it doesn't turn the other way round. Yeah, or, or it will snap. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it only turns kind of like, I don't know, 180 degrees. It doesn't turn further than that or it will snap off. Uh, but no, as you can see, very, very nice model. Yeah, I have to look at it. That, that's the correct way. Is that how it's meant to be? Why is the, where is the bloody lights at the back? Is that, is that like a manufacturing problem there? Because on the box, I'm not kidding. I don't know what they've done here, but as you can see, oh, the, then Gemini have done it wrong then. Oh, oh, yeah, well, I wouldn't be surprised. Look at this as well. Look at that bit where the back hatches. Look at that. The line's gone off the, um, off the, uh, off the print of it. So, <laughs> I have not a clue. Yeah, Jim and I have messed up. Yeah, I've noticed that. Yeah, okay, well, Dylan's pointed that out. Yeah, well done, Dylan. Sorry, I, I assumed. Yeah, they've, yeah, as you can see, see these little jewels here? They're, they're meant to be the, the lights. They're meant to be the landing gear lights. Sorry, I, I did not know that. I assumed, how is everyone? Yeah, I know. That is a little bit funny. But I, I, obviously, this is a lovely model. You know, this is a very, very nice model. Um, and yeah, we have a catch just waiting to come in, I think. Sorry, let me point down. No, I can't point down. Come on, kitty, get on camera. There it is. Hello. Psst, 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 psst. Misty, Misty. Hello, hi. Oh, she's always grumpy. Yeah, she's a horrible cat. Uh, but anyway, I hope you enjoyed, thanks for watching. Um, and I'll see you all later. I uh, hope you've enjoyed. Yeah, thanks Dylan for pointing that out. Yeah, everyone's saying hello to each other just as I'm ending off. Yeah, uh, yeah, it might be correct on the BA747 nose, but the VS747 nose is the wrong way. Oh, yeah, because this is the nose wheel, isn't it? For the, yeah, I had a 777 in PIA livery from Gemini. Um, I'm sorry, and it had uh, three wheels missing. Oh, God, uh, only just joined. Yeah, I know. Um, I'm just going to definitely count the wheels because... I know this is a problem people have. Uh, 
Um, we've got the little bits here, the little magnetic bits to uh, slot up. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we've got the right amount, um, I think, anyway. So yeah, anyway, I'm just gonna pack this box up. Uh, I'm gonna keep the model out, uh, obviously, uh, but I'm gonna use the, uh, the Virgin 747. Yeah, I know, it's a nice model. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's absolutely beautiful. Got the wing lights there, little strobe lights, got the tail. It's a very, very nice model. I I'll show you, I'm just gonna lift this off the uh, thing here so you can kind of see the scale of it compared to a hand. Very, very nice, very, very nice model. I just wanted to do this because I know people would think, oh, come on, Sam. Show us, show us it a little bit more, would you? There we go. Isn't that lovely? Absolutely beautiful. Like, I don't feel lucky to have this. I think it, it, it just came by chance that I went in and they had it out and I just thought, right, there we go. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's pretty big. It's a, I mean, I wish I had a, seven, a, a version 747 uh, to show you just in terms of size. Like, I want a 400 scale. But, yeah, it's all right, Dylan. It's okay if you've missed other streams. It's... Well, it's not okay, but <laughs> it's not okay on your behalf. But um, yeah, um, yeah, maybe you can join some other time soon. I might do some school streams uh, during the week. There's the landing gear. No, this is the landing gear from the Virgin, uh, just because I, I wanted to kind of demonstrate and I don't want to take it out because I'm going to unbox this again on the SL. Um, yeah, weird nose wheel thing. I don't know what's going on there. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all uh, later. Bye. I'll do this as well just to... There we go. Bye.